Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Sarah Plays Marathi in Immortal Empires. Cat walking on my lap. <laughs> there's a cat there. There's a cat behind me. There's a cat in front of me. There's cats literally everywhere. But anyway, that's not what you came to watch. You came to watch me crash and burn against the High Elves. Huh, so I did see that there are currently two armies spawned at the Witchwood. Don't really have a great garrison here yet. I could spend... Is it going to be worth spending the slaves to get this garrison up? It might be. It's still probably not going to stop them, but I wonder if Marathi can. Pyrrhic victory with medium casualties. So I'm going to say I'll probably auto-resolve this because... I had trouble with the High Elves and their range, and these guys definitely outranged me, and they're much boosted. <laughs> so I'm just going to take a Pyrrhic victory, For the witch king. and then I'm hoping I, I can... hop into the Witchwood and replenish a little bit. I also have the garrison here, so if this guy decides to attack me... I have that option, and I'm hoping those are the only two. That would be very good for me if those were the only two, because I'm going to have a lot of issues over here on my my borders. Tyrant of Nagalok. What now? My black arcs are going to be in trouble. I don't have very good units in these black arcs. Even this is okay, so where I'm at right now, they can't get to me. So I think I might do a little bit of restructuring here. Oh, there's my cat is right in front of the screen. Um, because I can... Oh, she's stepping on stuff. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. It's chaos around here. So I think I might swap out some of these Black Arc Corsair hand bows. Actually, I might just get rid of all of them. And then I'm going to get two artillery and then two more shades. And that's my recruitment. So that should be okay. Arnheim. Well, let's get something here. The Bleak Hold Fortress. 540. I do have the slaves after that big battle, so... Nakru Sith is trying to recruit over here. I got a couple of these ladies because I've heard they're good. Um, two turns there. I guess I'll get another shade since I have the cash. I don't think it's going to make a difference though. I don't think I can stave off all of these armies. Like, they don't have lightning strike, so... Yikes. I don't have any money to start building other armies. We'll just have to see what happens, I guess. Alright, so the Sid Blood Scourge. I'm gonna give him Blade Master again. Druki Queen. So I'm gonna give her another burning head because I've been using that a lot and then piercing bolts. Mother of the Druki. All right, Marathi has her pit of shades. What's this? Soul Stealer is good versus character, so that could be useful. Spiteful Conjuration is a debuff. Smoke and Mirrors is a buff. Although I do really want these two. I keep spending, I keep spending my points on the spells, but. Gotta try to spread them out a little bit. Trade with the world I'd walkers. Sure. Okay. Bring death. Setra is so funny. He always has like, I'd usually negotiate like diplomacy. Okay. All right. Well, I did what I could. Tyrion and Colin are probably going to attack Arnheim together. 
I cannot and I don't think I can reality. I don't think I can hold them both off Unwise. So it also says Alistair could get this there potentially so it's gonna be a rough turn all right so he went after my black arc which was I didn't think Alistair could get there oh my gosh guys I don't think I can get away Running from this back. oh I could Holy crap. All right, that's bad. But then I lost my recruitment, didn't I? Oh, shoot. It says I lose my entire army. I didn't think about this. I shouldn't have had her sit in the settlement. I may have to use the garrison as cannon fodder. All right, well, we're going to have to fight this. I don't have a choice. It says I lose my whole army. So we will have to fight this, and I'll have to try to maybe prioritize Marathi's units. They're pretty banged up, but I do have the garrison, so there's that. The other nice thing is that it doesn't seem... Which is weird, because this is the witch wood. I would have thought there'd be more trees. I have to be very careful with Marathi. Must not let her die. Yeah, I'm. it's very curious that it's like this. I fought in this map before with Ikit Claw. I'm not entirely sure how I want to set this up. I can't see where they're coming from. Alright, so we've got some Dark Riders that should help against... I've got the Doomfire War... Oh, every time I want to say Warflocks. Doomfire Warlocks. But... Oh, those are the, the repeater crossbows. Never mind. I don't have the Doomfire Warlocks in this one. Okay, so I'm going to have... Because I just... like we are ready. My range is so bad compared to the, what they have. And then I have these two ladies here, but they're more for flanking. I don't know if they're going to actually have a chance to do much. Like I said, I think I'm going to end up sacrificing this garrison. The merciless host. Dealers in death. Dark shards. Put down a spear unit on the side. Bleak swords. I don't have as many melee units as I thought I did, so Bleak swords. that kind of stinks. Merciless warriors. Bleak swords. Dark shard shields. Cold blooded killers. Mothers of murder. Turkey. Eager for battle. Turkey. Shades. Turkey. Eager for battle. Okay, so I have the harpies, which they might be good against. The uh, archers as well. Okay. 
Okay, so we have the artillery set on the rapid fire. They're speedy little buggers. I'm going to actually like move everybody here up. Cause like I said, I'm gonna really kind of just need to charge them because they are going to just shoot me the whole time. Do some damage with those dark shards if I can get in range of them. Jeez, like I said, don't let Marathi die like this, Sarah. Oh, my sorceress is already dead. Totally missed that. I should use my pit of shades somewhere. I don't know if they're going to stay there to be able to use it or not, but... I'm going to probably still end up losing my whole army at this. Ah! Shades! Merciless warriors! Harpies are dying, that's probably fine. See, the thing is, like, they, they stop obeying my orders, and I don't know if I'm doing something wrong with that or not. a good pit of shades area. Dark 
This is just chaos. He's almost dead. The merciless host. Okay, he is dead. Death is coming. Make them bleed. Master Truki. He's got regen, so that's good. Um, Shades. My front line is Die dying. <laughs> Truki, death is coming. As you say. I wish they would just like not just stop doing their thing, you know what I mean? Like if I tell them to do something, just Oh, what do we got here? Should have used that on the character. Okay, so there. Hopefully some of these guys are just routing and not like actually dead. We won, but at what cost? Let hatred fly. Withdraw. Okay, so she does have regeneration, so that helps. But my army's gonna have like nothing left to it. Harass him as much as I can. It's gonna not trigger, is it? Oh, would have been so great. Oh, no, I did get him. <laughs> oh, yes. Lovely. Okay, so I don't think there's anything else I can do here, so we'll just have to see the damage here. I lost my hero. I just lost track of her in the chaos of everything. Um, looks like I lost this unit. Not a huge deal. Yeah, it's rank five, but it's just a bleak sword. Um, did a lot of damage to most of his armies. Totally didn't even see he had a treeman. I wish I had known that. I could have focus fired on him. Okay, so I lost both bleak swords and my hero didn't really lose anybody in the garrison. New toys. Decisive victory and I lose the regiment of renown. Ah, oh, see I feel like if I fight this It's I I'm sorry to do this, but I just I don't feel like I should lose that unit, so I'm going to just fight this again and see if I can get away with not losing that unit, I think I have enough units that I can do okay. So this time they've got three archers, the treemen, their glade guard, is that what they're called? Their melee unit? All right, so I might just keep this pretty much the way that it was. I almost want to put these two, leave these two guys on the single target. Target the treeman. This guy is also an archer. I'm 
gonna oh, have her not God. do that just yet. Going now. Come with me. They're gonna dodge it. Maybe if I don't move her, no take some fear. damage, so she can cast Pit of Shades on them. And let's see, maybe I just... Send all my archer units in. It's the worst that could happen here, right? 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 Oh, they moved. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Hold, please, because I'm going to have all you guys actually fire at him. He's coming in hot. He should die fast. If I can get these crossbows off. Oh, he's not dying fast. Holy crap. He's got some missile resistance on him. Well, 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 well. He's gonna wreck one of my units, probably. Throw them on skirmish mode temporarily. Probably should have Marathi go after him. But I could also do this one versus character. Run away, guys! Run away! Alright, so he's dead, so now I'm just gonna, like, mass... Pretty hardy, isn't he? Gobble them up with Pit of Shades again. My revenge comes. Marathi moves. Vengeance. Actually, I don't want her to get the Pit of Shades. Or go after this guy, too. Oh, the Eternal Guard shields are here. That's why. All right, we'll just end it there. And I didn't lose my unit. I lost 17. It would be fantastic if those are the only two what elf armies I have to contend with because I'm going to have to turn right around and help defend Ulthwan except my replenishment here is going to be trash. Take these wretches away. All right, is he still Oh, he's still a thing. get the executioners. I don't really like them, but they're not the great. I am Morathi. Don't hold enchanting beauty. Okay, you better not say any of my units die because that would be just to garbage. Okay, so if I can get to Hag Hall I can replenish a lot better. And Should I force march? You I'm gonna force march. march. Okay. 
So that could have gone worse. Could have gone worse. Witch elves, scourge runner chariots, dread knights. I might actually get these because they are heavily armored and shielded. And they'll be good shock cavalry, I guess. I don't know. Dread Lord of Nagara. Do I just try to keep sailing away? Certainly not. Black hearted. Never. I cannot rewrite reality. Huh. What do I do? What do I do? I cannot. Dreadlord of Nagaroth. I admire your darkness. Alright, this is probably not wise, but I'm just gonna throw some regiments of renown in here just because I need them. Observe me. Observe glory. He is only rank nine. He does not have lightning strike. Dreadlord of Nagara. They'll be able to get me this other direction no. too. Far beneath an archmage. Supreme sorceress of Grant. I could. Think again. So if I pull Touch her it. back. Tyrant. Going ashore. Oh crap, this did not work out the way I wanted to. By K. This Attack is not gonna go well. Pulls. Now. What? Going ashore. Can I? With haste. All right. This is this is supreme. This is not great. <laughs> the portents are good. Success awaits. But at least I have him in the garrison. For better or worse, probably worse. Wish I could spend money to have him. Or not money, but uh, slaves. I wish I could spend them to have him go to uh, tier four faster. I'll put this building here. 35, yep. Oh, I don't have the money. Oh, no. All right, is there anything else that's building? No. Okay, control at Arnheim, Arnheim is fine. I have growth on here, but I almost wonder if I should do weapon strength. Yeah, let's throw up weapon strength. And then... probably fine. The witch would I have control. Throw growth there. Titan peaks. I also have growth. Okay. Oh boy. Alright, so she got two points that turn. Spell mastery. I have to go for that. Anarian's bride. And then I should have Grabbed another hero, but I didn't. And uh, actually, I might have the money for it. Sorceress. Another fire sorceress. Aggressive or cruel. Servant Whatever. of Hecate. Relics come forth. Okay. I could actually just get another. Then it doesn't leave me much of a front line. I was like, I could get another hero. No. Okay. Sorceress. Oh boy, that was a ride, wasn't it? <laughs> that was 
basically my full turn, so let's see what Tyrion does. Okay, so they didn't... I'm nervous about where they're at. I should have kept an eye on them more closely. What? What is it? Silosha really wants peace, but I can't afford to make Nagarond angry. I really need Malekith to just hurry up and wipe her out so that he can come help me. So that's, that's the ideal chain of events right there. And I'm so thankful the rest of the Wood Elves are over in <laughs> the other continent. They can wreak havoc. They can do whatever they want. I was more concerned about the Sisters of Twilight. Very strange that they didn't spawn the Sisters of Twilight. I don't know Naturally. how that works, honestly. Hag sorceress of Grom. Okay. So sorceress of I can feel their power. I'm gonna get another dread spear. Yeah. Well, yeah. Holy bonkers, guys. What now? We have a deal. Sorceress of the Dark Convent. She doesn't have lightning strike either. Nobody has lightning strike. Oh, I wasn't going to play this turn. I was going to stop. Okay. All right. Let me, let me, uh, <laughs> figure out these Mother items first. The I'm just going to throw these on some people. Uh, does anybody need an arcane Lord item? The black no. Uh, you can have it. Okay. All right. Well, I'm going to end this one here with this gross, disgusting thing of Tyrion. <laughs> Actually, I don't know where Tyrion is. Oh, Tyrion's over there. But all four of his armies here against my garrison, my this black arc. Which is terrible. So, um, I am going to... I don't know why I'm doing this. I shouldn't have done this. But anyway, we'll... <laughs> I'm all out of sorts. Anyway, I got rid of the end game, So now Marathi can at least come and help. Biggest threat now is just the high elves. So, almost to turn 75, everybody. Hope I can last until then. Hope you guys enjoyed watching this. And I hope you'll come back and see me in the next one.